Over the past few years, Rocketbook has released a variety of new reusable synthetic notebooks, two of the most notable being the Orbit, a top-bound clipboard-like notepad, and the Rocketbook Pro, a side-bound hardcover notebook. Currently in June 2022, I'm using the Executive Rocketbook Pro as my go-to notebook, with the letter-sized Orbit as a secondary pad for sketching out design ideas. These stand apart from the rest of the Rocketbook lineup because they use magnetic binding systems, which allow packs of bound pages, aptly called page packs, to be swapped in and out, allowing you to quickly switch up your page template on the fly. With this redesign has emerged the question of how to protect and transport those additional page packs when not in use. Enter the Rocketbook Page Pack Carrier. This is probably one of the simplest Rocketbook products I've ever reviewed because the name truly says it all, but there are a few things worth noting if you're interested in picking one up. So let's get started. At first glance, the Rocketbook Page Pack Carrier is similar to many of the company's existing notebook carrying capsule products. But upon closer inspection, there are some updates, which aren't all necessarily reflected in the product images on the company's website. Namely, the page pack carrier uses a recycled extra strength fabric that feels quite similar to their capsule's relatively smooth PET covers, with the exception that there's a noticeable square stitch pattern that somewhat aligns, though not perfectly, with the rectangular shape of the carrier. Additionally, there's no longer a stamped Rocketbook logo on the backside, and the company's nameplate on the front flap seems to be made of vegan leather rather than brown craft paper. Like the capsule products, the carrier seems to be reinforced with craft paper on the inside of the fabric covers, giving it a reasonably professional exterior, but a lightweight and semi-rigid construction, which so far has held up well on the few occasions that I've carried it in my laptop bag. At this time, the page pack carrier comes in only one color, this beige looking moon rock gray, as they call it and in two sizes, matched to Rocketbook's executive and letter size products. The smaller executive version comes in at 8 inches by 10.13 inches and weighs in at 270 grams or 9.5 ounces, while the larger letter size is 10.5 inches by 12.25 inches and 419 grams or 14.7 ounces. On the Rocketbook website, both are listed at a quarter of an inch thick. However, even when empty, they come in closer to half an inch to an inch. For comparison, they're similar in width to many of the other capsule products, and are about as compact as they can be while accommodating either the top or sidebound page packs of the Orbit and Pro notebooks, respectively. It's also worth noting that Rocketbook doesn't refer to the carrier as washable, which they've done with some of their previous capsule products. So while I was able to erase a little stray friction ink with some water, I don't suspect the craft paper would maintain its rigidity if it were left out in the rain. All things considered though, with the exception of a few loose threads that needed trimming, the build quality of the Rocketbook page pack carrier seems quite good. To open the page pack carrier, Rocketbook has opted for a variation of the Orbit capsule's magnetic angular flap design. Not a major feature, but I do prefer this over their squared off magnetic clasps. Once open, we see that the page pack carrier features a fixed base expanding accordion design, with each of the three tiers being offset slightly in order to raise and separate the contained page packs. This is important not only for ease of access, but also to ensure that the pro page pack binding rings don't interfere with each other, which would cause unnecessary bulk. The folding sides of the accordion mechanism seem to be constructed of a thinner vegan leather material, which folds internally. Accordingly, when you're inserting page packs, you need to be careful that all of the pages fall on one side or the other of this flap, otherwise it may fold or crease the synthetic pages, which tend to remain creased. Also. In addition to Orbit and Pro page packs, the carrier is well suited to storing Rocketbook's various coil notebooks, like the Matrix, Panda Planner, and Flip. This brings up the biggest issue with the carrier though, which is that if overfilled, the magnetic clasp simply fails to close or pops open. Over time, I suspect the carrier clasp will become more compliant, but this makes me wonder if a physical seal may have been a better option. 
To avoid this issue, it's best to insert the top bound orbit page packs with the metallic rings at alternating ends to avoid too much bulk at one end of the container. Similarly, the sidebound rings of the Pro Page Packs, or the coiled notebooks, should be facing out of the slot because the bottom of the pocket doesn't expand. And if you're going to store more than one page pack per slot, you should offset them a little. In my testing, the carrier slots comfortably fit one page pack or notebook in each slot, but can accommodate about five Orbit or Pro page packs before it can no longer be closed with ease. Again, it's best to play around with the Orbit page pack binding position in order to avoid bulking up one end of a single slot. Having said that, in a pinch, you could always rely on your knapsack to keep the clasp closed. Overall, the page pack carrier is an exceedingly simple but functional addition to the Rocketbook lineup. Though, after using it for a while, I think it's best suited to Rocketbook Pro owners rather than Orbit owners because the Orbit capsule is a more versatile and slightly cheaper alternative. By nature of its hardcover design and pen pool, the Rocketbook Pro doesn't need a capsule. It's perfectly compact and portable on its own. However, it doesn't provide any means for storing and protecting additional page packs, which is the sole function of the page pack carrier. Alternatively, the Orbit's lack of a cover makes it almost necessary to use it with a capsule if you're going to be storing it in a bag. And the Orbit capsule is very nicely designed, with plenty of additional pockets and pen loops in addition to a front sleeve that can comfortably store a few extra page packs. So unless you need to carry a whole lot of page packs simultaneously, I think the Orbit capsule is the better option for Orbit owners. And it's also a little cheaper coming in at $32 or $35 depending on the size, versus the page pack carrier, which is $34 or $36. Personally, I still like the page pack carrier as a complement to my Rocketbook Pro and for storing some of my sidebound notebooks, but I would like to have seen them integrate some additional storage for a few pens and a wipe cloth. All things considered though, I'm probably not the target user for the page pack carrier, because I generally stick to using a single dot line page pack with my Pro when on the go, so it's mostly just organizing my other page packs at home. But what do you think? Let me know using the comments below your thoughts about the page pack carrier and maybe which packs you use most. Otherwise, if you found this video helpful, please hit the like button, consider subscribing, and I'll see you next time.